that uh, the says left on the floor. Dumbass. I really am sometimes. Whoa! Oh, that's mother. Hi, Johnny. Good to see you again. Well, you put us in a very difficult situation, you know that. We can't let you go. We can't kill you either. I don't know what you'll do on the other side. So does anyone an appropriate solution? We inject you with a neuro acid, which will put you in a permanent coma. Exactly what we did with your mother. A simple and elegant way to put an end to our uh, collaboration. Kill you, mother. Yeah. Goodbye, Johnny. We will always be grateful for your help. Have to die anymore no one will ever be separated again what are you, what are you about? the containment field I'm oh, going to deactivate it the infra world will spread through our dimension oh this guy's an idea united in one world Death, Jody. Everything's gonna be just fine. You need sure. to trust me. Everything is gonna turn out fine. <sighs> Surrounded by idiots. Where's the rest of your team? Vince and Nick? <laughs> they have three months leave. They're on a beach on some exotic island, no doubt. Lucky bastards. Hey, I've got a couple of emails I need to send. You mind if I do that before we crack the bottle? No problem. Okay, come on. Let's see, look. I'm here. Go oh, help Jody. Come on. Pay attention to me. Don't you guys suck. You keep entities in this lab? Good God, no. They're all trapped behind the containment field. Aiden? Is that you, Aiden? 
This is a joke, it's not funny. Why would Aiden be here mm-hmm. without Jody? Give us a sign if it's you, Aiden. What is it, Aiden? Where's Jody? Lead us to Jody, Aiden. Yeah. Show us the way. Paints. Right. Now where? Let me find something. Um, I don't know. Oh, there we go. This way. Over there. Guys, you with me? Nice. You want us to take the elevator? Is that it? Freeman, I have level three authorization. He's with me. Mm, I'm sorry, Mr. Freeman. You do not have the correct authorization for this level. Maybe you could make an exception. I just want to show him. Sorry, sir. This area is level four classified. You do not have the right credentials. Well, I guess I need to deal with this then. You gotta get us past him, Aiden. Desk 42, hello. Hello? Hello? I think you made a mistake. Could you check again, please? Cole Freeman and Ryan Clayton? See? I'm sorry, you are on the list. My apologies. Um, go on through. Yeah, it's okay. I'll speak to your superior there. Hurry, I take us to Yeah, Jody. say that right in front of the guy that. Right, um. This way? Something moved. Right. Now where? In this room? Yeah, I do. Yep. Jody's here? Mm. Oh, come on. Door's locked. Jody. What? Why? Why would he do that? He's gone insane. I think he's gonna get his family back. And we gotta Agreed. Stop Let's go. And we're too late. Oh, Christ, he's done it. He's done it. You need help? No. 
It's a neural acid just drains out your system instantly, I believe. This way! Hurry up! Don't stand here! Get out of my way! Whoa! Dude, get out! There might still be a chance to reactivate the field. It is not ready to bleed. They're out! They're all out! Billies do nothing, yeah. Oh, dear, that. Whoa! <laughs> the shield isn't working. Yeah, because they dropped it! Jody, you're the only one who can stop this. Doc, it's got that. He took down the field. You gotta get rid of these goddamn monsters now! I ought to kill you, McGrath. But the last thing the Infraworld needs is a son of a bitch like you. Get out of my way. Clayton! Get me out of here immediately, Clayton! Agent Clayton! Yes! That's an order! You redeemed yourself a little bit. Consider that my resignation. You're all gonna die. You redeemed here. yourself a little bit. We're all gonna die. Yeah, you're a dumbass for going into this situation. Well. Come on. Come on. Well. You can do. There's one more thing I can try. Okay. Hurry! One. We're out of time. What are you doing? It's a portable containment field. It should protect me long enough to reach the condenser and trigger the manual self-destruct. Might be our only That's chance to close the rift. It's a long shot, but it's the best I got. Oh, come on, you're talking crazy, Cole. We need to get out of here with the military clean up their own fucking mess. Yeah, well, I'm going with you, trust me. Yep. Jody, no. Paul's right. It's our only chance. Right? I always figured I'd die a hero. Oh, here we go. The Black Sun is at the center of the dome. No one's ever been before, so there's no telling what we'll find down there. How much time do we have after we've activated the self-destruct? The system was designed to be activated remotely. The explosion will be practically instantaneous. We're not coming back. Bye. I think it's 
see here. Nothing to see here. Go! Go, 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 You're damn right I need I need to come on Hell it's yeah. Useless. Touch any of them just in case. They're all around us. I know. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh well, watch him. This is... Come here you deck. I can't find them. I call them, but they don't come. And blame. No blame. Maybe it's because they don't recognize yeah. you anymore. Your anger has changed you. I miss them. I miss them so much. Maybe there's still a chance to stop this. I know it's not what you want. I know it's not what 
what Helen and Laura would have wanted. Whoa. Jeez. Yeah, thanks. Do it. Do it for me. <laughs> yeah, thanks for causing the apocalypse and then killing yourself. Real nice. Crying out loud. I guess that's the thing. Jeez. There we go. Hi there, entity. Whoa. Mm. Yeah, you're not good enough. What the hell is this thing? Whoa. Huh. We go. We're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Don't worry, I'll get you back. Ah, get them! No, you sneaky mother! Get off me. Get out of here before I change my mind. <laughs> Still a deck. See you in the other side, bitch. Come on. Get off me! What? <clears throat> What's dead should stay dead. We inject you with a neural acid, which will put you in a permanent coma. Exactly what we did with your mother. It's too late, Jody. No, it's not. It's too late. Get off me! Come on. Oh, hi, you. Come on. Get. Get off me. I'm sick and tired of your stories! Jody, the 
this time, you're really gonna get it! Wow, okay. My twin. My brother. Still born. We couldn't leave each other. Our souls were bound together. I loved you and hated you for years. You were a part of me. Why do I think I'm caught between two worlds right now? get there one day. Why did I close my I, I I actually closed my eyes. I don't know why. <laughs> I thought I was in the middle of that explosion there.
made it. Jody, we made it. Aiden? That room is massive. Ever since the Black Sun was destroyed, my memory has been disintegrating. I spent too much time on the other side. Now it's eating away at my mind, erasing what's left of it. My memories are all confused, slowly self-destructing, fading like a dream when you wake up. I'm losing my sense of time. I no longer know what happened before or after. Everything's playing inside my head at the same time. It's like watching the same film looping over and over again. A chaos of images with no order. So I've been writing night and day for weeks, trying to put my life down on paper. If I forget everything, these pages will be my memory. Three months after the fact, the investigation continues in an effort to determine the cause of the accident that cost 283 lives on a Pentagon military base. Government representatives confirm that the authorities are working hand in hand with the investigators to shed light on this appalling tragedy. The CIA is leaving me alone for the moment. I suppose they're too busy building another condenser to worry about me. I know they'll never mm -hmm. abandon their experiments. Now that they know what's on the other side. Honestly, I don't give a damn. Now I need to reconstruct my life. My life without Iden. For as long as I can remember, I dreamt of living without him. Untied, without his constant presence by my side. I got what I wanted. I've never been so unhappy in my life. I feel like part of me has been amputated. Crying all day. I know it's stupid. Shit. I miss him so much. Hey, cool. But you're so alive. months 
months of nothing passing by. And I woke up. I knew it was time. Time to start again. To build a new life. so obvious. Deep inside, I, I always knew. I just needed the silence around me to hear what I was feeling. I told Ryan I couldn't see my future with him. We've been through too many difficult times together. Times I want to forget. He said he understood that he'd wait as long as it takes. I know I felt something for him. <clears throat> it just wasn't strong enough. <clears throat> How could I live a normal life again after all I've been through? Hell, who wants to live a normal life anyway? Boyfriend, job, counting the days till my next vacation. I wanted it for so long, but I finally realized that that life wasn't for me. So I took to the road. I've seen many rifts to the other side. Hundreds of them all over the country. Homes where strange things happen. Motel rooms that no one ever wants to sleep in again. Entities are all around us. They live in our houses, sleep in our beds. They're with us every second of every day. I know they're lurking in the shadows. Going on. I've died twice already. I'm not afraid of death anymore. Nice. Next time? That was freaking awesome. <laughs> My god. I was so afraid I lost it. There's no telling what we'll find out there. How much time do we have after we've activated the self destruct We're not coming back. Oh, it's super. I got that job Saturday night, and I'm locked up in here. Can't do it, babe. He's more than amazing. 
Thoughts, Mr. Mole? Um, that was an experience. It's far better than Heavy Rain. It was fantastic. It's such a well-built story. Like to... There's another end in there. Um, to basically live a life through somebody else. That's um, that. That's really. Uh, it's just such. It's hard. <laughs> I try not to talk about games as soon as I finish them because I like to normally go through them again. But I mean. Living a full life, basically. You're you're living her full life. Having to write that story is just nuts. Better than The Last of Us? I I would say yeah. Story-wise, I enjoyed this more than The Last of Us. But I, I, I like, yeah, it's a completely different game, but I like, but it's working into my, my, I've always enjoyed the supernatural and science fiction-y stuff. And this played right into my hand, like, it really did, it played right into what I love. I was, yes. Yeah, wow. Yeah, well, it's probably better than most movies, Spider, because of the fact that it's, um, just the fact that you get to experience it in a, such a weird way and uh, like it's so hard like I, I take on the character of Aiden it's so weird that I, I felt a real connection to Jodie because I felt like I was Aiden a lot of the time and I felt very because of the situation she's been in you protect her from them it's so weird And to make it her brother that was stillborn, her twin brother that was stillborn, it's really interesting. I suppose the cord could have, should have made it. Yeah, well, uh, that, see, I literally just went, I, I, I thought that it should have been slightly obvious, but it wasn't. Because they mentioned something about stillborn, oh, in the story. So they weren't lying, they just didn't mention that one was stillborn and the other one was fine. It's one of the... it's definitely... Oh God. It's definitely a thinking man's game. You've got to sit down and really... Yeah, wow. Like I'm playing it back in my head most of the time and then I'm gonna have to... I'm obviously gonna play it a couple more times through and change decisions and mess around with the story.